All right, so here we have a lot going on. We have a, an equation on the top with a fraction. We have an equation on the bottom of a fraction, and the whole thing is a fraction. So um, before we can flip and do the reciprocal, multiply by the reciprocal, I need to get this top to be one fraction. So I need to find a common denominator. So right now, this is one uh, over one. Therefore, my common denominator would be y. You could put one y, but it's the same thing. Now this first one was missing the y, so I'd have to multiply it by y. So two times y, I get two y. The second one already had y, so I'm gonna leave it by one. I don't have to simplify it at all. So now that they both have the same common denominator, I can put it all over y, and I get two y plus one. On the bottom here, so now I finish the top. On the bottom here, I'm gonna do the same thing. I need to find a common denominator. It would also be y. So this three, I need to multiply by y since it didn't have the y on the bottom. So three times y, I get three y. This one already had a y, so I don't have to do anything to it. Now that they have the same common denominator, I can make one fraction. So I get three y minus two all over y. Now that I have a fraction over a fraction, I can multiply by the reciprocal and solve. So I'm gonna leave that first fraction the same and I'm gonna multiply and flip the second one. Therefore, if I can simplify, I would simplify. I have a y and a y, they are gone. I can't cross anything else off, so I'm left on top with a two y plus one. On the bottom, a three y minus two.